Let's learn in this video how to decompile an ARM template into a bicep template. But why we want to do this operation? This is actually really useful for two scenarios. First one are the organizations who have invested heavily in ARM templates and they want to migrate into bicep. The second use case would be the organizations who are not using any infrastructure as code yet and they have maybe created their infrastructure using the Azure portal or the Azure CLI or another infrastructure as code tool other than the ARM templates and now they want to use BICEP. So being able to decompile an ARM template into a BICEP could be done with two different options. We have the easy option which is using a graphical uh, tool, which is the playground that is available on this URL right here, where you can go to up upload your ARM or your ARM JSON file on the right right here. And then on the left, we'll go to generate the bicep file for that template. So we see right here, this template creates a web app and an app service. And on the left, you can see the equivalent of uh, that file in the bicep language. We can also select one template of the existing uh, dozens of templates available on the GitHub repository for the Azure ARM uh, templates. Then we have the second option, which go to use the Azure command line. So here switching to my VS code, I go to explore the second option. But before that, I have actually here installed an extension, a useful extension for bicep within VS code that will enable me to do uh, to colorize my uh, my R, my bicep template and it will add the IntelliSense features and so on. So that's really nice and useful um, uh, extension to use within VS code. Coming back to my demo, so here I want to demo how we can decompile an, an ARM template into bicep. So for that, I'll go to take here a sample JSON file. This file actually creates a web app and an app service plan using some variables and some parameters. So it just creates these two resources for me. I'll take this existing JSON file and then I'll go to convert it back into a bicep file. So I'll use the Azure CLI. Uh, first, I need to go to install that Azure CLI tool using the command az bicep um, uh, install. Once it's installed, now I can go to explore the different commands available with the az uh, bicep dash h. And here we see two main commands. First one is build. This one will go to uh, build a bicep template and to convert it into a JSON file. And then the decompile, which would go to take an existing ARM JSON file and compile it or convert it into a bicep file. Let's start by exploring the decompile uh, command right here. So I'll go to run the command that will go to decompile my web app.json file. Let's give it a few seconds. And then here you would see a new file added in my project, which is webapp.bicep, which is my bicep template that will go to use some parameters and some variables in order to create the app service plan and also the web app. Note that here we get a warning for the decompilation is actually a best effort. It's not a very exact um, a process, so it might uh, generate some errors. So we need to review those generated uh, templates ourselves. Great. So it was how it was that really easy to take an existing ARM template and then convert it back into a bicep template. Let's go now to explore the other way around. So let's take an existing bicep template and convert it back into a JSON template. So for that, I'll use here the command az bicep build. And I'll go to build that generated bicep uh, template. And then I'll go to output the generated file into a JSON file called build bicep.json. Once that's done, I can see here my project. I have now a new bicep build.json file, which is the ARM representation of my bicep file. And again, that will go to create the app service plan and also the web app in my Azure subscription. 
Great, so those are useful if you have existing ARM templates. But what now if we don't even have an ARM template and we have only resources deployed into the Azure cloud using other tools like the CLI or the Azure portal or Terraform or Ansible or any other infrastructure as code tool. Let's see how we can take that existing infrastructure and regenerate or do the reverse engineering to, revert, to create the bicep template for that existing um, infrastructure. So here I'm inside my Azure subscription where here I have a resource group with two resources like an app service and an app service plan. I can actually go to export a JSON template describing these resources. If I go to right here to export template with this option, here Azure will go to generate a template for me. So it's doing that and here it is, the generated template. It actually generates two files. One is the template and the second one is the parameters file. So I can go to download this template into my machine and reuse it as infrastructure as code for my application. So because and now because we can convert JSON templates into bicep, that's what we're going to use right here in order to generate a bicep for my existing infrastructure. But here we want actually to be able to automate this process. I don't want to use the, R, the Azure portal. I want to use a tool that will allow me to automate this uh, process. So what I'm going to use here is the Azure CLI. And luckily for us, we have here, uh, if I go to show the command right here, we have actually a command that will enable us to regenerate or to export an ARM template into an ARM JSON file. Let's explore that command. So I'll go to use az group export, then the name of my resource group, and I want to output that into a JSON file. Let's give it a few seconds. And yeah, once that's exported successfully, I can see that now I have actually a file called exported.json that will go to describe again my web app and my app service using some uh, parameters and variables. And from there, we can take that existing uh, exported.json file and decompile it into a bicep file by running the command az bicep decompile. And yes, once that's run successfully, it will generate here a file for me called exported.bicep that is describing that ARM template with all the properties for my app service and my app service plan. Note here how we have more attributes because those are the default values generated by the ARM template itself. The scripts used in this demo are available on this GitHub repository on the folder 03 decompile arm to bicep where you will find all the uh, scripts and the commands that I have used into here. I hope you liked this video. Thank you.